Eugenie Bouchard makes painful Wimbledon confession 10 years after reaching final. Eugenie Bouchard reached the Wimbledon final in 2014, but has admitted she is yet to watch the match back as it is too painful. Eugenie Bouchard has confessed that she still can't bring herself to watch her 2014 Wimbledon final performance, calling it too painful, even after nearly a decade. The Canadian tennis sensation had an explosive year in 2014, clinching her first WTA singles title and reaching the semifinals of the Australian Open and the French Open. Bouchard's remarkable journey led her to the women's singles final at Wimbledon after she triumphed over world number three Simona Halep in the semifinals, marking her as the first Canadian-born player representing Canada to reach a Grand Slam singles final. Ex-US Open champion set to climb 405 places in world rankings after comeback. I broke world's top 300, but would make more working at McDonald's. However, she faced a crushing defeat by former Wimbledon champion Petra Kivitova with a score of 6-3, 6-0, which was followed by a period of struggle to regain her form. Now 30 years old, Bouchard opened up on the Tennis Insider podcast about her mental health struggles throughout her career, revealing that she hasn't watched the Wimbledon final because of the emotional distress it causes her. Bouchard said, I still, to this day, have not rewatched the finals because I just can't. It's like, too painful for me. I got killed, which maybe is a blessing in disguise, because you know when you come so close to winning a match, and then you lose it, and you're replaying over and over in your head what you could have done better on a break point or a match point. She added, Like I said in the moment, it felt normal, like I was just putting my head down and working hard and playing well, and just continuing this ride of confidence. I was so happy, and I wouldn't really say surprised. It's more like I believed in myself, or I've been working towards this every single day for for years and years and years. So it's kind of happy, but I always knew I could do well, and it was more of a relief for all the hard work and trusting yourself because I believed I could do it. And then I showed myself I could do it, so you kind of trust yourself, and obviously looking back, I'm like, wow, I did this crazy thing, but in the moment I was in my little bubble for this match. Bouchard also revealed that she only felt nervous before the final, despite not feeling anxious in the lead-up matches. She added, It's interesting, I never felt nervous before any of the matches in that tournament specifically, except for the final. I remember sitting in the locker room and feeling my hands sweat, and like my hands like, never sweat. And so it was like a physical reaction that showed me, wow, my brain is making me think about this differently. So, I was definitely very nervous for the final. The Canadian tennis player is still active in the sport, having recently led Canada to its first-ever Billie Jean King Cup title in 2023. Don't forget like, share, subscribe, my channel Babu Das News.